Hey guys and welcome to part 4. Now that we have our hit trace and our interaction up, we're going to set it so that we can possess this ship once uh, we uh, interact with it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to our first person character. He's in the first person BP blueprints folder if you need to find him again. We're going to go to our interact event. We're going to drag off the out hit on the line trace and we're going to do break hit result. This will give us tons of results and information for the line trace. <coughs> now, off the hit actor, we're going to do something called a cast. A cast, basically, it seems complex at first, but it's really simple. If there's a bunch of actors in the world, like so we have three pawns here, we need to know which actor we're interacting with and to access that specific one to cast him in the role. So these are all actors. These two are unemployed. We want to cast this one to the role of interacting to possess him. So what we're going to do is we're going to drag off the hit actor and we're going to type cast to flying pawn. We're going to connect that. This is also this has two benefits. It also checks to make sure that the thing we're hitting is a flying pawn, and if it's not, it'll do nothing. So just to make sure this is working, we'll drag off here and we'll type print string and hello. So if we uh, go up to something that isn't the flying pawn, we won't get anything. But if we go up to a flying pawn, it'll say hello at the top left. Same if we go up to this one. So now we want to possess them. So we'll get rid of our print string. We'll do right click get player controller. Off of that we'll do possess. Connect these as flying pawn. Connect that to the in pawn on the possess. Compile, save, save, play. Now we can go up to any of these spaceships and possess them. Possess this guy and there we go. Now in the next episode, we'll be, as you can see, one of the bugs is, is that our old pawn is left here. So in the next episode, we'll correct that, and we'll also make it so that we can get out of our ship by hitting F again. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next